I'm a physiotherapist here at Marple Physiotherapy Clinic. I became a physiotherapist because I was an athlete myself in high school and university, and I un endured a lot of uh, physical injuries throughout my uh, playing career, and uh, physiotherapists are the ones that helped me recover and, and get back into playing, and also they taught me how to prevent those injuries from happening in the future. So uh, then I went on to pursue my physiotherapy education, uh, keeping that in mind and knowing how much I could help uh, athletes and the general public. So today I'd like to talk about muscle strains and sprains in the body and one very important principle called the RICE principle, R-I-C-E. This principle is very important when you initially become injured because an injured ligament or a muscle usually has an inflammatory response and sometimes that area can become red or swollen and also can be sensitive to touch and to prevent um, the increase in inflammation in the first few days, we like to apply the RICE principle. So the RICE principle stands for rest, ice, compression, and elevation. So for example, if you were running and you sprained, say you twisted your ankle, and you saw that there was initial swelling and irritation and redness in the area, I would say that the first thing you should do is probably go home, put some ice on it, lay down on the couch and rest, uh, use the ice and maybe a towel to compress the area and also elevate it. The most important thing is not applying the ice directly to the skin as well as not leaving the ice longer than 15 to 20 minutes. However, this whole principle of rice will help decrease that initial inflammation and is always best to do in the first two to three days of an injury. Um, yes, and, if, and also after two to three days of applying rice, uh, it's probably best to go in to see your physiotherapist and determine what was the cause of this injury and also what are ways that you can prevent this injury in the future, as well as exercises and, and therapy to help the recovery so you can return to your sport without pain. And I think that's it for today. Thank you all for listening and I hope to see you guys soon in the clinic.